Hello everyone, Natalie here from Serpwiz and I want to welcome you back again into our Samrush series where we do um, reviews and tutorial videos about the different tools that Samrush offers. So basically, here in Serpwiz, that is what we do and um, we do reviews, tutorials of different SEO tools in the market and for this particular series, we are doing SEMrush. So, um, just a quick background in case this is your first time, um, this is your first time seeing something from us, then uh, we've actually been doing reviews and tutorial videos or semi tutorial videos of the different tools that SEMrush offer. And I am currently logged in as a free trial account because I understand or we understand that not everyone would want or would have the capability to sign up for a, a paid trial or a paid um, subscription account right away. So what our goal here is that we give you a glimpse of what Samrush offers and in turn then you will be deciding on it for yourself if um, signing up for their paid subscription is something that you would want but yep basically um, with a free trial account I have got no bad experience as of yet I was able to utilize all of the tools except for some of course because um, of course with a free trial account there are some limitations but yep um, Previously, I've finished SEO, local SEO, advertising, social media categories, and we are now um, doing the content marketing category. And previously, on the last video, I have discussed about the content marketing dashboard, and today we will be highlighting on this feature called topic research. Alrighty, so unlike what I've noticed is that unlike all the other tools that are present under um, these categories, topic research do not have any additional information um, on this page. Well, I think that's because it is um, pretty much self-explanatory. It's just something, it's just a tool that, that can help you generate any topic that you're thinking of. Maybe in terms of keywords or just an overall topic that you want to work on. For your content so um, let's just try it for ourselves to see how it goes um, a, a topic that I'm thinking of right now is thinking of a dryer stand I know it sounds um, very random but this is a topic that I've been writing currently for for one of our clients it's, maybe that's why it's on the top of my head so yep, I'm just gonna type that in and then select the US. Um, but if ever you want, you can um, filter or change the country of your preference and then your language um, per se. And after that, you can just hit on hit get content ideas. All right, so um, immediately after we get this loading page right here. Let's just see. Alright, so searching for the most relevant topics. And there we go. We have now the results for the specific topic that I've entered. And as you can see here, we have content ideas. Um, so these are what came up. The form of cards. So show more of this subtopic volume there are also uh, metrics associated with every card there is you can also view this as an explorer overview our mind map and you can just quickly change the topic that you want and generate a new one for that so here are about 40 questions that um, you can use to formulate your articles and then some headlines. So this is very useful because, I mean, as a writer myself, I am often conflicted with um, 
what titles to use, what questions to ask, you know. So um, having this tool definitely gives you an advantage because then um, you'd have all these ideas right away and you're sure that they make sense because after all, they are being put there um, with a certain metric. That's why you know that they are ranking. So um, yeah, they, they are ranking and as well as they are very much relevant. So here we have more. If you click on this, it would show up to be like this. So that is it. And then you can also favorite the ideas and you will be able to view those right here. And then um, you can also export this into an Excel SX file. And yep, you're pretty much, you've pretty much got it. Um, it's just a simple tool, very straightforward, not, uh, no need to do anything um, that is, uh, that will require too much effort on your end. Just think of a topic, type it in, and then you'll get those ideas right away. So that's it for the topic research feature. Um, I, I hope you like this video and found this very helpful. Um, and we also hope that we'd see you guys all again as we do more of the videos under the content marketing category. And yep, thank you guys so much for watching and see you on the next one.